we have confirmation, the grand jury has convened in the Sean Diddy Combs case. It's been a long time coming. But well, y'all, CNN just reported about an hour ago that a jury will be coming together to convene in Puffy's case, which means people can come together to show evidence in which he possibly can be convicted. But I'm going to just be honest. Once the FBI gets involved, they possibly know they have a case. You won't be getting away. That's no ifs, ands, and buts about it. You might not be getting arrested today. It may not be tomorrow, but some ching ching will be coming soon, if you understand what I mean. If y'all remember back in March, his houses was raided. We now almost in June. Okay, he gave out that bullshit apology to Cassie about a couple of weeks ago, one or two, which was still in May. Which this man knew. If CNN, if CNN and TMZ knew that he was going to be convened and a jury was going to possibly start to listen to people, um, testimonies against him, trust me. Puffy knew this too. So meanwhile, in the time in between, he's busy allowing his son to do diss tracks and all other type of things to make it seem like he's unbothered. Trust me, he's very bothered. Unbothered could not be him. He's definitely faking because anytime this man, for one, he's named in not one, not two, not three, not four, not five, not six, not seven, but eight lawsuits, okay? Cassie's was just one of them, one of many. Let's talk about the factors of how he got shine out there in Belize, right? People think that they slick and people think that things is under wrap. That's not the case because now he's also being brought up on not only drug charge, drug, drug trafficking charges, but money laundering charges too. And I don't think that's for here. That's for somewhere over there. So it's going to be some questions that definitely have to be answered. The feds is coming. And they definitely not coming to play. Let's get into the factors that um, before any of us knew, me and you, Puffy knew that this shit was about to hit the fan. Let's just be honest. This man been doing whatever he's been doing or he been doing for years under the protection of the same people that are looking for him at this point in time right now. So the fact is that when they were going to raid his house, they couldn't even tell the officers who house they were actually going to raid just to keep things under wraps as much as possible, baby. Because when you got people in places, high places, okay puffy deals with people in the industry he deals with people in the p police department he deals with people in the congress like the p politicians and all that type of different stuff so um yeah catching him is not going to be easy it's really going to be rough because he got the money to get himself out of situations that me and you don't you understand i'm gonna just be honest we would have been underneath the jail if this was something that we was dealing with Okay, our story would have been being told after we was already behind bars. Just being realistic. This man done had the opportunity to watch too many movies drop in the factors of him. He's sitting at home watching them just like me. Did you hear me? He's sitting at home watching the takedown of Dick, which is him. Make it what criminal you know got to sit and watch every move that the FBI made on them until they got to them. And then they sitting there just watching it like, oh, yeah, they talking about me. This man was outside dancing, smoking blunts, doing his everyday thing, if that's what it is. But what's crazy is, right, this ain't been now. This, this should have been before now, like way back when, like even down to Kim, his wife. His kid's mother, rather. Okay, Kim Porter, anytime you could do two autopsy reports and they come back saying two different things, somebody got some explaining to do, my friends. That's not a coincidence, all right? How do you buy a casket for a person before they even die unless you plan on them dying? Oh. Oh, okay. Whatever happened to the baby mother 
from the, the Biggie video. You ain't see she got going? Remember the, the young lady that was in the Biggie Smalls video when he first came out and she had the baby on her lap in, her, in the pool? That's Puffy's first baby mother. You ain't seen her for years. Okay? It's a reason for that. That, that didn't just happen. He wasn't just beating on the women that he was with. He was also beating on the women that were working for him. From what it's been told, allegedly, Mary has been also hit by the hand of this man. Say what? Yes. Mary J. Blodge has witnessed and been a part of getting a smack down by the man that is being questioned at hand. Now, I'm just going to be honest, okay, because it has been man, woman, and child. It seemed like that has been coming out now that states that Puffy had did something to them. And once all of this actually, once everything actually comes out, because see, some things they have to keep under wraps until they actually erase, arrest the person, right? But once he's actually arrested, right, the things that's going to come out that we thought we knew, but actually had no idea, yeah, it's definitely going to be some sh Now, about the other people, right? That call they self coming forward. I'm not talking about the victims. I'm talking about the people that was in the rooms with Puffy while he was doing what he do. And now they feel like they got a story to tell to me and you. I feel like y'all just as guilty too. Y'all just like his co-defendants. And at the end of the day, people just coming out now trying to tell what they know to clear their slate. Because before one, two two years right these last two years people was dying to be at a diddy party people was dying to be in the company of diddy not until the downfall of diddy started to come about did people start to come out and i'm not talking about once again the victim i'm talking about the friends of his that took a part in his entourages right because um where's jay-z why he's so quiet what, why is he why is he so quiet? I'm telling you, if they want to find the real tapes, they better shave Jay-Z head because the memory cards and all the information is inside the nappy ass dress. Why you think that man don't comb his hair no more? The best place to keep your shit to make sure nobody else ain't getting it is on you. So they either in his hair or within the cavity somewhere. Wink wink. Wink wink. If you understand what I mean and where I'm going with that. But yeah, I'm going to keep y'all definitely updated with this Puffy situation. We're going to keep it going around until we actually see his ass go down. And when it happens, we will report on that too, the way that we do. But in the meantime, in between time, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Make sure you share this video so we can hit the out the rhythm and get out there so the people can know. Protect your booty hop, okay? Seriously, it's not safe out here. Um, Half of the people that's in the industry, right, they just, right. Anyway, this is your girl Tay, and your girl, out. La 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 Tay's were a, a.